I'm Todd Carver, President and Owner of Portland Marine Electronics. Today we're going to talk about transducer, transducer selection for your boat. Uh, the transducer is one of the most important pieces of your system. Um, the better the antenna, the better the performance of the equipment. The transducer for a chart plot or sonar uh, module is the most important part of the system. Here we're, lo we're looking at a, basically an entry level transom mount transducer. There are many different styles of transducers. Uh, starting with transom mount transducers. There are also uh, through-hole transducers and in-hole transducers. A through-hole transducer is where you physically cut a hole in the bottom of your vessel and install it and glue it in. A in-hole transducer is where you do not cut a hole in your, the bottom of your vessel and it shoots through the hole. We'll talk a little bit about those later. The reason you're in market for a transducer is because you want to find fish. The Aramar P66 is a great entry level transducer. As you progress into higher quality fish finding, you'll find yourself leaving the transom mount plastic transducers and digressing into these through holes and the larger transom mount transducers. This is a stainless steel SS60, single element, 600 watt. The difference between the P66 and the B60, this one is mounted through the hole. And by mounting it through the hole and underneath your vessel, you are in the cleanest, purest water possible, and you are eliminating a lot of the turbulence that is associated with a transom mount transducer. Stepping up into multiple element transducers, you would be looking into the SS-164 and the B-164, whether you have an aluminum boat or a fiberglass vessel. The SS-164 is a triple element, 1,000 watt transducer. Uh, there's a conception that the more the power, the better the fish finding, and that's not necessarily the, the all, always the case. Yes, you are going to have better fish finding, but you are, the, the main reason for, for higher power transducers is for depth. You can reach deeper with 1,000 watts of power than you can with 600 watts of power. New to the market in the last year, you're looking at the transom mount, the TM260s, the TM258, and the TM270 style transom mount transducers. These transducers do not have water speed built into them no, as well as the through hole transducers, but it can be added. Multiple elements, anywhere from three to seven elements, uh, come in the TM series and these are also 1000 watt transducers that have very high target definition. Speaking of target definition, more the elements, more the target definition. Um, thicker, thicker the elements, higher quality, those are the things that you're looking for in your research for a new transducer. There's a variety of transducers out there, hundreds and hundreds of transducers available for vessels across the United States. Here in the Pacific Northwest, Portland Marine Electronics, we've narrowed it down to our four most common styles of transducers for our geographical area. If, you're ever, if you have any questions regarding what transducers right for you, please look us up and give us a call. We'll be glad to take care of you.